That's it. Go get it to her. Oh gosh, okay. Three, oh, two. Happy Easter. How's it? Hey Liz, welcome to Mongoose Max Hawaii and Happy Easter. The channel. Okay, it is Sunday the 9th and it's April. <laughs> Get the month thing going on. Oh! Look at the cat. We gotta turn on the fan. We gotta start, start the stuff going on. The ghost box. Yes, it is Easter, so we'll do a little old and new. Uh, as soon as we get this going on. Reward. Reward. That's it. <laughs> Reward. Thank you. <laughs> That's it. Let's just do old and new right now because it's Easter. And sometimes it's hard to have faith. So it's Easter. <laughs> so Jesus. Girlfriend. Jesus. Okay, with girlfriend. Jesus dies, like all the way dead on the cross, because there's these, you know, not all the way dead. Yes, all the way dead. From Yugoslavia, I got this one. So he dies all the way dead. They take him down. They put a shroud on his face. And when they take him down, then they put the shroud on his body. And they put him in the tomb of Joseph of Arimathea. Sometimes they think, they say, we got to take down these dead executed people before the sabbath starts and this other guy had a timeline where the there's a sabbath on saturday and there was a sabbath on the friday two sabbaths in a row that particular year back then so the sabbath would be starting on thursday sunset so jesus might have actually been crucified on a thursday and there was two sabbaths the Last Supper is on wet. Anyways, there's all kinds of stuff like that, you know. It's really kind of interesting. I, I digress. Let's just go right to this. What, what, what are you doing? Okay, we're trying to do this fast. Wait. Okay. There is a selection out of the old. Isaiah. Oracles concerning Babylon, Edom, and Arabia. The oracle concerning the wilderness, the sea. As the whirlwinds of Egypt swept down from the desert to the terrible land, the stern vision is told to me. The betrayer betrays and the destroyer destroys. And this one says hell. Okay, thank you, God. <laughs> On the New Testament, you know, I'm just going to take right out of the new a selected passage that is Easter. Now, Matthew and Luke took from Mark the book of Mark is earlier. The ending of Mark has a second ending that was added later, and the first ending of Mark ends with the girls. The chicks that found the tomb empty ran away, scared. That's what. It, that's how it ends. Let's do the Easter thingy, and come on, let's just do it. The resurrection of Jesus, Mark 16. The Sabbath was over when Mary Magdalene and Mary the mother of James and Salome brought spices so that they might go to anoint him. And very early on the first day of the week, Monday, when the sun had risen, they went to the tomb. They had been saying to one another, who rolled away the stone for us from the entrance of the tomb? When they looked up, they saw that the stone, which was very large, had already been rolled back. As they entered the tomb, they Let's saw... Go. <laughs> Please go. As they entered the tomb, they saw a young man. What is this? He wasn't in a boat. They saw a young man. Uh, gosh, where am I now? Dressed in a white robe, sitting on the right side. And they were alarmed. But he had said to them, do not be alarmed. Are you looking for the Jesus of Nazareth who was crucified? He has been raised and is not here. Look, there is a place where they laid him. 
but go tell his disciples and Peter that he is going ahead of you to Galilee. There you will see him just as he told you. So they went out from, fled from the tomb for terror and amazement had seized them and they said nothing to anyone for they were afraid. So they just booked it and went, mm, the empty, the tomb. empty tomb. tomb. That's Easter. Now from there, right? When, when they went in there and they saw a young man sitting there in a white robe, supposed to be an angel. And when Peter and James, and etc., when they came later, they saw the cloths here, barrel cloth and the face cloth, two separately. No, because I'm, I'm just saying, you know. Uh, you know, uh, uh, what? What? That's it. You know, what? I mean, and, and you can hear this stuff and go, well, that doesn't prove anything. Maybe, you know, they took them away or something. And I don't know. But there's lots of other stuff that's mm, different. But for Easter, I'm going to say there's a couple things that are huh? about uh, if you want to believe. The face cloth which they have traces back with a it's been in one spot ever since the year 16 616 AD so it's been there since the year 600 before that they have a lineage or the uh, providence province province the province of it is testified by these bishops but it's for sure been there since 16 616 now the face cloth has blood stains and some you know uh, whatever stains on it that's it no image but the blood stains on the steam it matches 200 times it matches the shroud of turin and that's what we're gonna talk about just a little bit the shroud of turin <laughs> the shroud of turin oh wait this one this is the, this is the one the shroud of turin what happened to my face so the Shroud of Turin, wait just a second. You're welcome. Special effects need some. <laughs> the Shroud of Turin, they carbon dated it and it was medieval, but the carbon dating was bogus because they did the, they did it wrong. So they recarbon dated it and found out that, yeah, it's 1,900, uh, <clears throat> 70 years old, plus or minus 200 years. So yeah. It goes all the way back there. So the Shroud of Turin, the material is old enough. There's so much other stuff, but the blood stains match the other one. So for sure it's that old, but the blood stains on the Shroud of Turin and the image overlap. But where the image went poof, underneath the blood stains, the, sh the image isn't there. So the blood stains were there first. So in order to forge that thing, if they could do that, they'd have to paint all the blood stains and then do the anatomical image on it. <laughs> That's what they gonna do that. Yeah, go try that. But um oh so the image isn't painted. The blood stains is AB positive. It's actually blood. They can't DNA it, but they, they know it's pieces of DNA, but they can't sequence it. And the image is made by radiation. It's not painted. It's not nothing. It's just like a very thin layer. This whole image is this 3D. It was like the body. Was they calculated it as in order to do this with the UV ultraviolet. Vroom, it would take, um, where's my notes? Um, just a second. Ah, six to eight billion watts. Six to eight billion watts, which is about, about 500 million searchlights. 500 million, 500 million searchlights, like a big searchlight, 500 million of them going off in one four hundred one hundred and forty billionth of a second so one over 140 that's really quick it's like a nano it's like nanosecond Boop. billionth of a second 500 million floodlights to make the image i they they you can't even do that with all the laboratories on earth 
So, um, and the cloth fell, <laughs> and then he's gone, and there's this guy in a white robe sitting there. Uh, he's gone. So there's a little more to the empty tomb. Anyways, you know what? Uh, let's try to go fast. <laughs> Here, they're getting away. Oh, what's more time? The observatory from Monokia is going to be removed. Oh, the uh, soldiers from Hawaii are in Alaska, and next they're going to go to <laughs> so, uh, Australia. So Monokia is going to be bye bye. Well, one observatory. This panda bear is going bye bye Yaya. Because bye bye Yaya? I, I, I guess he was. That's, that's the bookie man, John Wick. Bye bye Yaya. <laughs> I want to talk. Sure you do. Israel is attacking on Syria because Syria attacked on Israel because they had a thing in the mat in the moss in a little moss they threw off fireworks and they brought in the police. Pope Francis presided over Easter Vigil. Yay, Pope Francis, he's gonna kick in. He's still kicking. Yay! I mean he's doing it. He got ill and there's an eclipse in a year. So get ready. And Across America, everyone's going to eat one billion peeps. Talk about the, the thing about one billion peeps is red dye number three is cancer causing, and they haven't banned it yet, so don't eat the red peeps. <laughs> oh God. They're having Easter stuff, and then more Easter stuff, and then Easter stuff. Oh, oh I gotta relax, just relax. Remember back in the day, like 19, whatever it was. <laughs> Shoot. What the heck? Uh, okay, back in the day, 1965, that's what it is. These guys, hey, they come in with their keg, huh? 1965. He's drumming on the keg. It's actually rum, believe it or not. I'm in this picture mode. Oh, gosh. So Seagram's Distillery unveiled to Leilani Hawaiian rum. Le Leilani Hawaiian Rum, coming now for you at the Royal Hawaiian Motel, delivered by the Outrigger Canoe. Okay. And the UH Volleyball, the weaning some more. Oh, on to Senior Week. Well, UH Volleyball is kicking butt. Uh, they really are. Um, I don't know exactly what, but they're victoring out again. So, oh, look. Oh, oh so uh, that's a pretty good picture. It's like that. You got the mid air action shot thing and there it is <laughs> we need a little oh super bomber brothers yay uh, and the tutus are doing hula oh, oh edith edith on the workshop what the 1974 the tutu hula and life and death <laughs> apparently people in the usa are, are croaking earlier in the average run around of the thing and the Easter promise. Okay, we'll deforestation. Uh, or we'll cut out all the trees or something. And, oh, but they're still kind of growing. They got roots still. <laughs> I don't know. Easter promise. Huh? Okay, there's a lot of kinds of stuff. Oh, whoa. So allow them to build on Kakaako Makai, says that one guy. That's my opinion, as I think I says. But nah, nah. Warren says that. Uh, stop restricting rights to the public. Stop to the voting thing and the dying and the banning books and the chita chata. Uh, don't waste money on your massive project. That was the uh, SWAT <laughs> SWAT campus. Technology campus is a strategic benefit. That's like someone opposing. Oh, I'll just end with this one. Replace Good Friday with another holiday. Each year, about this time, I'm puzzled at the fact that Good Friday is an official state holiday in Hawaii. It's a Christian religious holiday not relevant to many other religions and non-believers here. It is a remnant of missionary times and colonization. colonization. The separation of church and state is ignored. Another holiday, preferably a Hawaiian one, ought to be substituted. Paul Davis, a Hawley in Uwanu. Okay, you get you get Hawley points. <laughs> You get all these points from two to doing the hula. I don't know. I'm just amazed that the Strata Turin goes all the way back. It's pretty authentic. You gotta figure. And you know, most historians, almost any cre credible historian, say, 
Jesus actually, the person, historical, historicity, Jesus actually existed. He did. actually walked around and said stuff. You know, the others, the miracle parts, and you can question, but you, he actually did exist. Most historians will say that. Yeah, that's true. Yet, 40% of people say he didn't even exist. And the shot of Turin, 6 to 8 billion watts. <laughs> 140th of a second. I don't know. Happy Easter. Maybe the resurrection has proof. Is that proof? I don't know. Okay, that's it. Uh, oh, get up my sunblock. It's gonna uh, really, oh, get really sunny. Uh, really, uh, oh, really get up my sunrise. It's gonna be really, really fresh sunny. Fresh resurrection. Fresh resurrection. Fresh sunrise. Fresh peeps. Fresh resurrection. Fresh aloha. Fresh aloha to you. Fresh peeps. Fresh aloha. Fresh aloha to you. Beep, beep, beep.